Hello, my name is Katie Schuster and this is my informative speech on a personal object. My speech is titled The Gay Adventure <laughs> and I would like to start us off with a quote from Warren Buffett. It reads, price is what you pay, value is what you get. Throughout the speech, I will explain what my object is and why it means so much to me. So my object is this spoon. I am obsessed with this spoon. It is my favorite spoon and everyone in my house knows that this is my spoon, even though everyone else uses it and they love it as well. Um, I'm going to say it's like five or six inches and it's really skinny and it reaches a lot of things. Um, and it's this gorgeous silver color and it has these lovely engravings on it, the flowers. And then it also has the name engraved in the back and it says gay adventure. I don't know why it says that. I'm assuming it's because that's the maker of the spoon, but I'm not totally sure. And I believe it said that it was from the 1940s. That's when this was made. Um, now that you know what my object is, let me explain why it means so much to me. First, it's because it reminds me of my family. I My whole family loves antiques and weird little tchotchke things. Um, so finding this when I was antiquing with my dad in North Carolina, um, it really struck a chord. It made me think about my grandma on my dad's side and my mom's side. Um, and just value, you know, how I grew up in the kitchen and, uh, you know, things that are older and they are, you know, have, I feel like a better quality to them. More heart and soul in this guy than a regular old spoon. Um, and it really makes me happy. I don't know what it is about it, but this spoon just brings me so much joy because the length and the structure of it reminds me of myself because it's skinny and long. Um, and uh, I grew up in the kitchens with my grandmothers, so anything that reminds me of a kitchen will make me happy as well. Um, it works perfectly for stirring my coffee and eating yogurt, getting all the corners of that stuff, and ice cream, and it can reach super deep in the peanut butter jar, get all the way down there. It's so great. Uh, that is the main thing that everyone loves in my in the house. It's because it is so long and skinny that it can just get in there. Uh, grapefruits, I have always had a hard time finding a good grapefruit spoon, and this guy gets the job done real well. Um, I also have this like funny little quirk of myself where I love getting goofy gifts. I remember in middle school, I asked during a secret Santa exchange to get a spatula just so I could have a spatula for the day. I don't, but it was honestly the highlight of all the gifts that were given that secret Santa. I do remember. And I think I still use the spatula. It was a good spatula. Um... So now I hope you understand why my spoon has so much value to me. Um, it has character and love that may not be seen, be seen by everybody else, but as long as I cherish it, there's plenty of value intact with this guy. Everyone and everything has value. That is something to remember. And so let's cherish each other and truly appreciate what we have to offer the world. Even though this is just a measly old little spoon, gives me a whole lot. So I'm sure everyone else and everything else does the same for someone.